Hey guys, you clicked on this video because you want to see what is the best shoe to climb on your asphalt shingle roof or the best shoe for roofing. So guys, so I want to tell you a little bit about me and about my company. My name is Zach Blinkensop, and I served active duty in the Navy for eight and a half years. And now I'm a licensed general contractor in nine different states. And I have my Florida roofing license. So everything that we say here, we've done before, and we've done projects all the way from Billy up the street, all the way through the United States government. So I just want to get you guys a little bit more acquainted with who I am and what we do here at Digital Roofing Innovations. Okay guys, so I'm about to show you five different types of roofing shoes that's the best to do an inspection on your own roof or if you're a roofing contractor, a salesman or adjuster, which roofing shoe is best for you if you're gonna be doing a lot of climbing on roofs. So first we're gonna start off with golf shoes. Now, a lot of people think that golf shoes would be a great shoe to climb on your roof because it's got cleats on it. Well guys, let me tell you when it comes to what is the best shoe to climb on your roof? You want something with a lot of surface area and something that's gonna make a lot of impact with your shingle, but also is not gonna to be too hard that's gonna cause your granules actually to come off. So with the golf shoe, if you look at the bottom here, you see these spikes on here that can cut into your granules. Even though these are plastic, it can still take off your granules. So if you slide a little bit on your roof, particularly if it's really high pitch, you're gonna pull your granules right off of your shingles and on top of this is an awful surface area for your roof if you climb on it. So whatever you do, make sure you do not put on your golf cleats and start climbing up on roofs. Okay, next is just your standard running shoe. Uh, I have a Brooks running shoe, it's my favorite running shoes, but this is a also not a great option to climb on your asphalt shingle roof. Now, if this is all you have and you've got a really easy roof like I do, it's no big deal, it's not a problem, but it, the steeper you get, the more chances you can fall off of it, particularly if it's two stories or more. I mean, you're talking about not only are you going to get injured, it's probably death. Even something with a short pitch roof like this one, you can fall from eight feet and kill yourself. So you want to, this is a very important subject that we're actually talking about. All right, so on this Brooks, you notice that the shoe has this big arch in it. And because what that's designed for is when you're running to do this, right? That's not great when you're actually walking on a roof. So if you put it like this, you see how much of the roof is actually, or the shoe is not actually touching the roof. So this is not a lot of great surface area. And so on this shoe, if this is all you got, you have an easy roof like this, it's not a problem, but not a great option as a roofing shoe. Okay, next is like a hiking boot or any type of work boot. So I'm gonna show you the bottom of this one. And as you see, this one's worn off a little bit since I've worn it so much, but this also has ridges for helping you climb or when you're going down and hiking. A lot of work boots are like this. They have big ridges in them. And again, if we're talking about surface area on top of a roof, it's not the best for getting a great surface area. It might be better than a regular pair of tennis shoes, particularly running shoes, but it's also not the best option. Not an awful, but not a, the best option for an asphalt shingle roof. So the what I, in my opinion, probably is what the best value shoe overall is, is just any type of skater shoe. Um, and so one thing I like about these, is it has a big surface area. As you see that the shoe's flat, right? So now this one does have some waffles and you can see probably some granules and stuff. From, I've walked on roofs in the past, but you get a lot of surface area with these. You know, they're gonna stay on your roof. You're not gonna slide a lot. They last a long time and you get these for like 40 bucks. Um, and sometimes less, you want to look for ones that have as much flat here as much as, as possible and not with a lot of waves or cuts or anything. It's got a flat bottom. So this is the best overall value of any shoe you can buy. And again, the steeper the roof gets, the more, the heavier duty your uh, shoe that you need, particularly on this chart in terms of um, what's going to be best to climb up on those really steep roofs. But if you're a, an adjuster or you're a salesman, 
or uh, you know, you, you're just a homeowner and you're wanting to climb up on your roof, this is the best option you have that's not a specialty shoe. All right, so our last option is the Cougar Paw. These are the shoes when it comes to roofing. I'm gonna take it off, but this is the who's who when it comes to when it comes to roofing shoes. So now I will want to I want to say this before I start. If you have a metal roof, this exact option is not the best. There's some uh, there's some magnetic option uh, boots out there that are way better for metal roofing. We are talking about asphalt shingle because it can be dangerous if you're walking on a metal roof with this boot, particularly in the summertime if it's sweating like it is down here in Alabama when it's hot. This will not be your best option, but for asphalt shingle, the Cougar Paw is the absolute best option climb on any type of roof, particularly high pitch roofs. So it has this to the strap here to further tighten down uh, your shoe inside the boot. Um, heavy duty laces. And the thing that makes these different is these have these pads that can be taken on and off here. So these pads are designed, if you've never seen an asphalt shingle roof, come off, you've probably seen the guys with their nailing are using uh, nail guns. They've got a big pad up with them. They've got like a, it looks like an old couch pad. Well, that's because it is an old couch pad. So what Cougar Paw did is they made, they had took the same kind of technology and made it a little bit more durable and put it on the bottom of these. And so you get so much surface area and it's flat. So these things do not move and it does not damage the granules on top of your roof. And when you're going climbing on anything over a 712 pitch, this is the shoe you should be wearing. You get away with it maybe with the skater shoes, but this is the type of shoe that you should be wearing. And when it comes to roofing shoes, this is the Cadillac of all the options that's available. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed the video. I showed you a bunch of different options on shoes you can use to climb up on your roof. Remember, golf shoes aren't really an option. Running shoes are probably, if that's the only thing you got and you have an easy slope roof, that's probably where you can start all the way up to the best option, which is the Cougar Paw. Now keep in mind the Cougar Paws are a little expensive. They normally sell for a little bit over $200. So unless you're someone who's gonna be using them a lot, it's probably you know, something you really don't have to have. If you wanna have your roof inspected and you feel like you're comfortable climbing up there, make sure you have at least some skater shoes on. Uh, if it's steep pitch or just call a local roofing contractor to come out. Most people offer free estimates anyway. Now guys, here at Digital Roofing Innovations, we want to always give you the easiest way to get something done. Now we may give you some multiple options because you may not have some of the tools, but at the end of the day, we want to give you the easiest, best option on whatever it is that we're showing you how to do on the outside of your house, particularly on your roof. Now, this applies to both homeowners and then new people into the roofing industry. And always at Digital Roofing Innovations, we believe in a modern approach with traditional values. Have a great day.